Well, I'm not pretty sure what's an algorithm. Algorithm? <laughs> <laughs> um, Say that word again. Algorithm. Algorithm. Oh, an algorithm, oh boy. I'm pretty sure, <laughs> I know an algorithm has something to do with a Rubik's Cube. Would be like a numbers? Uh, like an, like, I know Instagram's algorithm. An algorithm is a set of guidelines that describe how to perform a task. Well, I'm all about rhythm, uh, right? So an algorithm is a recipe for a computer. It's a series of steps that a computer can execute one by one to solve a problem. In the early days of artificial intelligence, algorithms were used to search or to solve puzzles or to play chess. So it's a very useful thing. But there's a catch. And that is that for the really difficult things that we want computers to be able to do, it's like telling the difference between a cat or a dog or driving a car or making a robot walk. Turns out algorithms are not enough. And for those problems, eventually, we ended up resorting to a process we call machine learning, where you don't tell the computer what to do step by step. In other words, we don't tell the computer, here's how to tell the difference between a cat and a dog. You give it examples instead of giving it rules. So you might give it a 1,000 images of cats and a 1,000 images of dogs. So you're going to say, now, use uh, statistics to figure out what are the signatures of, of these two. Eventually, if you do it fast enough, you do it enough times, if you have enough of these neural networks arranged in a particular way, it works. All these signals flow through it and in parallel reaches the conclusion it's a dog or a cat. And it's a black box. You can't look at rules. You can't explain to anybody how it's doing it, but it does it perfectly. It's like magic.